This is the Bruce Lee collection. Be water, my friend. What's up, guys? It's Gavin, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we will do an unboxing and review of this new Rastaclat Bruce Lee collection. But before we begin, I would like to give a huge shout out to Rastaclat for sending these over. They recently had a Memorial Day sale, so tell us down below what are the clats that you picked up. Don't forget to use Gavin Marshall 20 to receive a one time 20% off at Rastaclat.com. With that being said, let's get on with the review. Bruce Lee was a famous martial artist, movie star, and cultural icon, but his philosophy has caught fire around the world with the new generation seeking meaning and consciousness. He continues to teach us how to cultivate our truest selves and be in harmony with the world. It is with great honor to present Rastaclat's limited edition 2020 Bruce Lee collection. The Bruce Lee family has teamed up with Rastaclat to celebrate the philosophy and inspiration of the iconic martial artist. This infinite optimism silhouette features a black and yellow braid, complemented with matching hardware and a Bruce Lee silhouette on the barrel. Each bracelet comes in an exclusive infinite optimism collector's box that can be used for display. It consists of 100% polyester, while one size fits most wrists. This B water bracelet features in white contrast the renowned quote, water can flow or it can crash. On a blue single lace design with a Bruce Lee silhouette on the matching barrel. Each bracelet comes in an exclusive B Water Collector's box that can be used for display. This one family silhouette features a multicolored gradient braid complemented with matching hardware and a Bruce Lee silhouette on the barrel. Each bracelet comes in an exclusive one family collector's box that can also be used for display. Among the three Bruce Lee clats, this is my favorite because it has the reverse colorway of the iconic yellow jumpsuit that Bruce Lee wore in the movie Game of Death. Fun fact, the director of the movie made Bruce Lee wear the yellow jumpsuit so that after Kareem Abdul-Jabbar kicked him in his chest, the footprint would be visible. Another reason why I really love this clat is because of the Bruce Lee silhouette in the barrel and because of the aglets that look like nunchucks. It also comes with a photo card and a quote by Bruce Lee that reads, Optimism is a faith that leads to success. Now on to the next bracelet. This is a flat lace bracelet which fits people with smaller wrists better. And around the clat, it has the iconic be water my friend quote. And in this aglet here, it says be water. While on this side, it says my friend. And it also has the iconic Bruce Lee silhouette on the barrel. It also comes with a photo card where the front reads Be Water My Friend and at the back it says Bruce Lee believed that one must be like water which is adaptable, flowing, always changing, and growing and never becoming fixed in one style or one way. It applies to all aspects of life. Be water, my friend. Now, for the final bracelet. This is the One Family bracelet. This is the most vibrant bracelet among the three. It's different from your regular braided Rastaclat because it has the purple lace locks here. And each aglet is different because on this side it says one and here it says family and you still have the iconic Bruce Lee silhouette on the barrel. The color of this bracelet looks like it was inspired by Linda Lee's attire. 
In this picture, you can see Brandon, Bruce, Linda, and Shannon. Brandon Lee is the protagonist in The Crow, and Shannon Lee, if I'm not mistaken, is a martial artist, businesswoman, and an actress. I think she's also into music, but comment down below if you know more about her. At the back of this wonderful photo card, you have a quote that says, Under the sky, under the heavens, there is one true family. Don't forget to use Gavin Marshall 20 to get a one-time 20% off at rastaclad.com. Thanks again for watching. This is Gavin. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment down below your thoughts on the new Bruce Lee collection. I'll see you in the next one.